Hey everybody, I want to say something to Eagle Passa. We have now got a new video from the migrant that made a death threat towards Nigel Farage recently. In case you didn't see that video, here it is. Englishman, Nigel Passa, don't talk uh, shit. Nigel Passa is his terrible pronunciation of Nigel Farage, by the way. About me, you not know me. I come to England because I want to uh, marry uh, with your sister. Don't talk about me more. The letter video. This is not good, my friend. You not know me. I gonna come to England. I gonna pop, 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 mother. Passa, man, you know. This is mother passa. Every country. No now, I think we all know what that pop, pop, pop meant. That meant bang, bang, bang. Okay? That was very, very clearly a death threat. Uh, towards Nigel Farage. Now, of course, this has gone viral everywhere and maybe the guy is actually waking up to uh, the reality that there might be consequences for these videos that he puts on the internet. Uh, so he's tried to pretend that this wasn't really a death threat and he's done nothing wrong. And, uh, you know, he was just pressured uh, by people around him um, and he had no choice. I mean, just absolute rubbish. And, you know, Nigel has said, these are the kind of people we are letting into Britain but the Home Office doesn't seem to care. They have allowed this guy to come into the country on a small boat. He is now here in Britain. And now that he's here in Britain, he's posted another video. Hey, everybody. I want to say something to Eagle Passa. Eagle, Eagle Passa. Passa. Listen, my friend. I, I can speak English, but uh, I have translate. Listen, listen, my friend. Hi, Igel. You don't know who I am. I know that someone has given you the wrong information about me, that I am dangerous and that I am on my way to England. You look a little bit dangerous with that tattoo of a gun on your face. I mean, I I wouldn't really look at this guy and say, oh, that looks like a lovely chap. He's got a tattoo on a gun, of a gun on his face. And we've just all, we've all just got the wrong idea thinking that he's a bad guy. Hmm. Hmm. But that is not true. I am a TikTok talker who usually broadcasts live and vlogs my everyday life and shows where I am and who I am around. I left Sweden to put my past behind me and start a new good life in England. On my way to England I ended up in a place on the border between France and England where people were armed who were moving people across the border. They asked me to film a video where they also wanted to appear in the video with their weapons. I couldn't say no as I was in a danger zone. I have nothing to do with people's guns. Oh, okay, okay. You know, what a lovely guy. He just, he was forced to make the video making a death threat uh, to Nigel Farage. He was forced to make um, a video with a bunch of uh, guns around him because, you know, it would have been dangerous for him not to make the video. Sure, sure, sure. Like, I know that these mafias and whatnot that put, do the crossings, you know, you've got to be on their side um, and you've got to play ball, but... Would they have said to you, sorry, mate, you can't make this illegal crossing if you don't do a video, a, a TikTok with these guns? No one's buying this. Although Yvette Cooper probably is and she'll wave through his asylum application pretty quickly. Don't spread wrong info about me. I am in England and would be happy to meet you if you want so you can see me in real life and explain to you who I am. The person who has given you the wrong information about me is my enemy and wants to smear my name as he has previously done in Sweden. He himself is abroad and spreading false rumors about people. Hope you understand what I am trying to explain to you. Eagle Passa, listen my friend. This guy give you uh, false information. This guy in Sweden, uh, he uh, uh, want to... Uh, kill me he give money to somebody uh, now right now he see me i'm in the uh, front creek i want to go to england he want uh, he want to uh, watch me he don't wanna uh, i go fix my life in the england uh, you must know i'm not bad guy every country know me uh, two thousand uh, people uh, look uh, my life every day uh, every country know me, them I am, Madapasa, but uh, uh, 
You must know I'm done. I I'm not danger. I'm not danger, mother passer. But why have I you got that tattoo you on your face? You want. Uh, you Looks pretty dodgy to me, me, mate. You can talk with me. Uh, but, yeah, uh, just get coffee. I'm sure Nigel will like be up for a coffee after you everybody, did what you uh, did. Think I'm danger. Uh, I don't wanna uh, somebody uh, think so. Mother pass. Love you, me mother fucking eagle passer. Oh, I want to say something. Uh, I do like this. This is my character, my mother passer, eagle passer. Uh, all people I my uh, all my followers uh, he like uh, I tell him Brr, pa, 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 mother pasa eagle pasa son of my dicker. Oh really? That's just how you sign out of every video. That I mean, it seemed like what you were saying that it was very very clearly aimed at Nigel Farage, and I think we all know what it meant. No one is buying this rubbish, especially with that stupid tattoo on your face, mate. Uh, There's my character. There's. I don't wanna use That's your trademark, is it? The, the, the Going pop, pop, pop. There's, I'm rapper, mother passer. I, uh, I have tattoo. You must uh, know what the, why I mean this tattoo. Does not mean ta, 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 ta. What a freak! But I mean, you know, as, as funny as it is, I mean, seriously, this guy is apparently now in Britain and came across on a boat illegally of course you know the border force here they all just welcomed him in uh we don't know or at least i don't think we know exactly where he is is he currently at some processing center is he in a hotel i don't know however after that video he made saying well with the pop 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 making it quite clear um that he wants nigel farage dead he should be out and at the you know he's not hard to identify with that big tattoo on his face so at the uh, uh asylum processing centers they should be able to spot him quite quickly and get rid of him straight away he should be deported immediately after making death threats uh, to nigel farage but we know that won't happen so nigel farage now has to walk the streets knowing that this guy is lurking around britain and that our police and our government and our home office will probably do absolutely nothing about it, okay? And Nigel Farage, he's a high-profile person, so this is getting attention, but what's this guy going to do to ordinary members of the public? I think we got a little bit of a taste of his culture and his views uh, on women there when he says, haha, I'm coming to uh, England so I can marry your sister. What's he going to do to the girls of this country? I don't know, but I have concerns. This guy should not be in Britain and this should be a big, big wake-up call about the illegal migration crisis that we are in. Bear in mind that right now we've got Keir Starmer in talks with um, Ursula von der Leyen talking about signing up to a deal with the EU where we take another 30,000 migrants a year from them to, you know, spread the load across Europe. I'm very, very concerned. I have no faith in this government. They told us that they would stop the boats and they would smash the gangs, but there is absolutely no sign of it whatsoever yet. And in fact, we've been seen, we've seen an uptick in illegal crossings lately. And now the Home Office is reopening migrant hotels to take care of them all. This has to stop and it has to stop now because I worry that something very scary might happen. You know, no, doesn't have to be Nigel Farage, could be anyone being killed we could also be letting terrorists into the country completely undocumented what are they going to do when's there going to be a big attack i don't want innocent brits to die because of these innocent uh, not innocent illegal crossings that we keep seeing happening i'm very very worried we will see over the coming days if we get another video another tiktok from this guy trying to explain himself let's see what happens I'm Chloe Dobbs. This has been another video for Reason to make sure you're subscribed to our channel and I'll see you all in the next one.